Hey everybody, it's Carrie Louise. It is the end of week three of doing beach body, of working out every single day. That's 21 days straight. I think now can I officially consider it a habit? We'll see. Uh, I This week the big change was I got up at five o'clock every morning. Usually I would get up at six and I worked out before I got ready for work. I worked out and then I bathed and ended up with a lot of extra time in my day actually by doing that. I didn't have to do it in the afternoon and one thing I found about found out about doing it in the afternoon was sometimes I would dilly dally getting it started and I also wasn't spending as much time bathing and spending in the bathroom and you know I just I had a finite amount of time I couldn't linger so that it's really saved me a lot of time which is kind of nice. As far as the consistency doing it every day Okay, I'm a thinner person, but I, I am not in shape. So that was kind of my main thing I wanted to work on, but I wasn't sure what kind of results, you know, they talk about the results all the time. I wasn't sure if, what I'd get and I've, I've seen a difference. So this is not scientific. This is not 100% accurate. I'm not sure I measured exactly in the same spots on my body, but for my measurements, everything changed. So my chest actually gained an inch. I guess that's a positive. Oh, and I, I measured myself wearing the same outfit, wearing the same clothes. So it should be pretty accurate and everything I measured twice. And that I got the same number every time. So my chest, I gained an inch. I'm guessing that's more like my back muscles. Uh, my right arm, I lost an inch. No, excuse me. I lost half an inch. My left arm, I lost an inch. Uh, my waist, I lost three inches and that was a concern of mine. I was getting kind of poochy, but three inches in three weeks. And that wasn't me sucking in it either. That wasn't me like that. That was actual like, wow, that's, that's significant. Uh, my, let's see my hips. I lost an inch. My left thigh, I lost half an inch, and my right thigh, I lost half an inch. So I lost everywhere except for my chest where I gained. I think for my right arm, or excuse me, both my arms and my legs, my thighs, um, a lot of it is just toning. And um, my muscles are getting tighter. Maybe not necessarily, they're maybe getting more defined, but they're also getting tighter. So I, I'm guessing that's what there is. So yeah, it makes a difference. <laughs> even for someone who is thin, but out of shape. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, next week. So I finished the XP Pilates this week. Like the program, it got a little difficult at times this week, but I, I still press play every day and that's what's important. This week, what I'm gonna start doing is only doing workouts Monday through Friday, again at 5 a.m. And I'm going to now do a program called 600 seconds, which I think there are 80 total workouts and I will do one of those a day. So it's 10 minutes, but from the little bit I've looked at it, it looks kind of intense, but I can do it intense for 10 minutes. And then I'm going to do an XB stretch. So it'll be the same person, Andrea Rogers, that did the XB Pilates. Uh, she will also be doing the stretch. Those are five to 15 either five minutes or 15 minutes. I think I will opt for the 15 minute every day and I will see how that goes. So those are my changes. So being consistent with your workout, whether it's a beach body thing or just anything, it makes a difference. I encourage you to try it. Toodles.